this your boy Hype Beast and we back with another video. So somebody asked me, somebody asked me, do I believe in marriage, right? Guys, do you guys think I'm a sucker? I will never submit to a woman, bro. Marriage does not benefit a man. If you look at the divorce rate, the divorce rate in America is 80%, no man, 50%, 80% fouled by fucking females, dog. You're gonna you are you are gonna be a bitch and get married, right? Knowing there's an 80% chance of your wife leaving you, you're fucking dumb. <laughs> you're really fucking retarded, dog. What is the pros of marriage for men? For a man? Nothing. You're fucked. You're fucked and you're fucked. Oh, tax breaks. Oh my god, you guys have kids and you guys get tax benefits. Be a fucking man and make more fucking money, dog. Stop being a bitch. Only beta males get married. But listen, if you're Indian Muslim, I'm not knocking you. Get married because you guys take marriage more seriously compared to Americans, right? You know what I'm saying? Like I know this, right? I worked with a few Muslim females, right? And they take marriage real seriously. They talk highly of their husbands, they're very submissive, they wash their clothes, you know, they cook it and clean. But to an American woman, oh, that's being a second mother. Yo, these bitches is crazy, dog. I will never marry an American woman. You crazy as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Especially these modern chicks. Oh, no. They're only marrying for security or to impress their family or friends or take a picture on Instagram. You know what I'm saying? That shit is all bullshit, dog. And then she gonna leave your ass and fuck you over financially. I say you should only get married, right? If you're marrying your high school sweetheart and you guys are 30, you guys got a career. She supported you throughout college and she was always there, right? But other than that, don't get married, dog. Most married men are bitches. They get on their knees and say, hey, can you marry me? Fuck my life up, please. <laughs> you crazy, dog. Once you get on that fucking knee, you lose all power. You're submitting to a female. My grandfather been with his girl for 20 years, right? She tried to press the marriage shit on him, right? But he was not going. But guess what? He's a fucking man's man and she's still with him. And this was like six, seven years ago. Still cooks and clean for him. You know what I'm saying? You know what that shit proves? That it's real fucking love. She love him for him, dog. And not for a fucking ring to impress her family and friends. These modern chicks, bro, you could take care of her. You could protect her. You could lead. You could pay all her bills. But because you don't got a ring for her, oh, she gonna leave your ass. Because she want to impress her family and friends, dog. I'm telling you, bro, the divorce rate is high for fucking reason. Real love is fucking rare. Just ride the wave out. Bro, I'm going to prove my point that it ain't real love, right? Most men get married because their wife gave them an ultimatum, right? Like, listen, you're going to marry me or I'm gone. If a female ever gave me an ultimatum on marriage, dog, <laughs> I'm out of there in a second like I'm a magician. You crazy as fuck. A female will never control me, dog. I'm a grown-ass man, dog, with an alpha mindset. Now, I don't walk around saying, no, I'm alpha because that, that shit is corny. But I have an alpha mindset, the abundant mindset. But a lot of dudes on earth are bitches, dog. They live for females and they live to make a female happy. You know what I'm saying? Most men that's married, bro, they're beta males. They be like... Let me check it with my wife. Let me get my wife approval. These niggas is bitches. They can't make decisions on their own. They need help from other people. And then they be talking about, oh, happy wife, happy life. Like, what? <laughs> you crazy as hell. I ain't living to make no chick happy, dog. She got to make me happy. I'm the king of the house. I mean, it's vice versa, but y'all get what I'm saying with this shit. I'm not submitting to her, dog. I'm not being her little bitch or puppet. You know what I'm saying? I run shit in the house. I run the show. She follow my lead, dog. I'm going to respect her and shit like that. But listen, no wife is controlling me, dog. Tell me, these dudes be bitches once they get married, dog. Most married men I know, they're not happy. They regret this shit. They and then, guys, you got to remember, right? When you get married, you're committed to one vagina to the day you die. <laughs> that sounds like hell to me, dog. Think about it, right? What you have for dinner last night? Rice and chicken. Will you eat rice and chicken every day to the day you die? Probably not, right? Okay, then. Don't get fucking married. <laughs> and then you got dickheads nowadays getting married at 20, 21, 22. Okay, when you're 25, you're going to regret that shit. Regret it, right? When you're on Instagram Monday, right? And you see your guys in Mexico, you know, fucking foreign hoes and baddies having the time of life, right? While you're on the couch with your wife, the pussy's boring by then. He done had it a million times. And you like, damn, what the fuck did I do? Y'all fucking dumb, dog. You got to think smarter, dog. Don't let these girls pressure you into marriage and then her family, her father, her mommy press you like, oh, when are you going to marry my daughter? When are you going to propose? Have your own fucking mind, bro. If you don't believe in marriage, don't fucking marry your chick, dog. And you guys got to remember, right? After a certain amount of years, bro, a marriage loses its spark, bro. And your girl will fucking leave you. A female could wake up tomorrow and be like, I don't like you no more. Just like this. Look at this clip I'm going to post right here. Watch this shit. He's ready to off himself. He don't know what the fuck to do because his wife of 37 years left him. And I feel bad for him, you know what I'm saying? Because he was fucking blue-pilled his whole life. Oh, you want to hear a sad story? I've been married for 37 years. And two months ago, my wife left me. I'm shaking. After 37 years, she left me. And she left me for another man. And these last two months of my life have been the most difficult, 
the most painful by orders of magnitude. And I'm 67 years old. What am I supposed to do now? Start a new life? I don't want to start a new life. It hurts so much. And I still love her. And she was my best friend. And I don't know what I'm gonna do. But yeah, that's my opinion on marriage. I think you're fucking stupid if you marry a chick. You know what I'm saying? You're beta. You're soft. Just look in the mirror and tell yourself, I'm a bitch. <laughs> I submitted to a woman. I'm a bitch. But yeah, so like, comment, subscribe. I see all your comments, you know, comment video topics and hype beast out.